Well, it's Black Friday. No specials over here, though. No customers either. I'm finishing up some of them uh, Mary Kay knives. I did. Uh, I finished them up yesterday, but I did. I did. I did all. Let's see. How many I have? Five, four. Let's see. I had. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. I had six, so I did two of them over here, you know, on uh, Wednesday. And I did four of them on the Cali last night and yesterday. Well, I wasn't happy with them, just from an observation looking. So I took uh, these two back out since I didn't have anything to do over here today, or at least so far. I sharpened these on the edge pro. I mean, on damn, don't fire me. Oh my god, did I say something bad? Oh god, Ooh. wicked edge. I had a flashback from when I used to have one. Not that there's anything wrong with it. I, I like the machine, it's pretty nice to be truthful with. Stand by. You just can't seem to get that kind of edge that I like to look at on a Cali, you can with the uh, wicked edge. From a customer standpoint, that thing looks a whole lot nicer. Of course it is, I think. I've got to shine the brass up on this one and get it all cleaned up. That's the only thing else i got to do to it. Uncle Henry. I don't think I told you that the other day. There's that china, baby. The wicked edge, edge. I even sharpened the serrations. Okay. Well, I went and got a cup of coffee. As I was coming back, a guy walked up with two knives. Stand by one minute. Over here in the sunlight where it's a little brighter. It's awful shady under this place. One is a, I don't know what this is. Maybe some kind of, well, it ain't a neck knife. It's too big to be a neck knife. But it kind of resembles a little neck knife. Hmm, interesting to say the least. Uh-oh, there goes the neighborhood. Pakistan. God. And this one, this is a fairly nice little knife here. This is a Gerber. Half and half, I call it. I don't see any model number on it. This is Gerber. Nice little rubber handle. Nice grip. I like it. But, like I said, I don't see any model number on it. I don't know what kind of Gerber it is other than a Gerber. She's dull on a loom. Anyway, we got some action. Portland, Oregon, and Pakistan. I got this little old Pakistani knife neck done. And the Gerber. He didn't want the serrations to drop him because he said I charged too much. But anyway, I did them anyway, you know, what the hell, you can't not do them. It would look kind of odd. It wouldn't be very sharp. I know I think I showed you this market thing once before. It's a big round circular type market, and this is like a big vendors, open vendors building. It's curtains on that side and all new garage doors on this side. And on the back side, they got these little stores. 
organic grocer. That's a classroom. And right here is an empty building. My wheels are turning for this empty building. Rent is not very much. I'm going to go take a look at it now. There was a, the enchanted lady, the lady that does the bakery with the uh, gluten free, non dairy stuff, was thinking about going in there, but she wants them to do too many things to it, so they're not going to let her in. Or she's declined, I should say. I don't think you'd be able to see too much. It's just an empty little building. It's got a door in the back, a baby air condition. Just right for knife sharpening and selling metal detectors. That's when my wheels are turning. We'll have to stand by for more for that later. Check that baby out. It's an antique Camaro. I got some nice stuff in from uh, Old Dawn. Old Dawn. Old Dawn. He's on the uh, Wicked Edge forum. Sharpening stuff. I forgot what it was. I ordered. I know it's some tapes and standby. Mm, peanuts. Mmm. I don't like them. I got some polishing tapes for the Edge Pro. I use them on the Wicked Edge. I needed a medium Spyderco triangle rod. I never have had one. I got a white one. I bought one for a spare. Finer grip. Coarser grip. And some super erasers. I never tried one of these. Let's see how they go. I'm babysitting. Jack babysitting Hank. That's Hank's mama from Seattle. She's in for a few days. One of his mamas. He's got two.